There is. There's a Studiopolis Act 1. No, there isn't. In ult? Yes. Way. But that's the only song from Sonic Mania that they added. Way. Yeah, Studiopolis Act 1 is in the game. Yeah, go to like Windy Hill Zone and Green Hill Zone. Check it out. It's in the I'm menu. never going to this version of Battlefield. <laughs> never. Not happening. No. I just snorted, dude. Wow. I never, never. do that. I, I See now I hate the, all this music, it sucks. Alright. Whatever. I wanna get back to like how Dill kinda clocks Venya and how he's gonna how I, I wanna see him if he can do it again. Because we're not biased here. I, I love am, both of these players. I am screw Rob. I'm just kidding. I'm absolutely joking. I swear to God. Don't lie. Oh, look. No, I am. I'm, I'm being serious. I don't know what you're talking about. I love both these players, man. They're both amazing. Cause, th okay. I'm sorry. I want to get off topic. Why? Wait. Why is still at 90%? This is. This is Cause he got up there like five times. Just you really. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Can we both talk about? Okay, granted, it's the weekly, and I'm literally the only one who's going to look try at the screen, man. No, <laughs> wait. Please, please just see. actually look at the screen. I'm begging. Wait. Ah. Good lord. Literally oh look God. at the screen, and then you don't have to ask me how what a how great he kill. got to 90. <laughs> please, God. Sometimes it's not my fault. I, I didn't see that happen. Jazzy, how are you going life? to become the world's greatest commentator if you don't look at the screen? I want to be the world's best Bayonetta player, even though like we're literally a joke. I, I'm sorry. There's like seven best Bayonetta players. Do you not know that? Okay, but like actually, game one. Yes, actually. <laughs> like, There's wait. the back air and off the level goes ah. Dill. That back air from Dill though, I'm sorry, that was kind of nice. He kind of like, Clocked many of them, but he, like, he went low for it. He, I'm not gonna lie, he went low for that. I mean, Rob can afford to do that because of how good his recovery is, but it's just, it's so smart because, you know, it stays out forever. You know, it's pretty much the, the strong hit is gigantic. It really is like no weak hit of the move. You know, and he can just afford to go low to do it because of how good his recovery is, man. Rob is an amazing character, dude. Wait. I'm so sorry, never mind. <laughs> Alright, forward air. I kind of, I was just Holding wondering about the legs. gyro because I thought it teleported because I saw him throw it up. I didn't then... even hear what you said. I was just watching the match, honestly. Oh my god, what Die. a call out. Damn no, it, not he's yet. Not we're, dead. we're on Battlefield, but that was close. He kissed the blast zone on that time, and speaking of kissing, he kissed this sweet luck by the ledge right there, just able to get the invincibility of the ledge grab right as that down air was coming out. Ooh, good spacing on the part of Venia as well, getting around that. That almost haagen him. Almost Hagen scooped him real quick. Oh. Yeah. I like to call moves that scoop like that the haagen does. I think it's funny. It's like, how many scoops do you want? And down throw. That's an up tilt. Oh, no, he's just up jumping air. right up and doing the up air. Yeah. That's not easy. It's a lot easier to just do the up tilt off of the burrow if your opponent is uh, not going to mash or they can't mash quick enough, and then combo that into the up air because then you have plenty of time to react. Just putting the up air there... You gotta time that right, and you gotta read the eye. It is not as easy. I feel like people don't. Ooh. Oh god, that was kind of cute. That was hilarious. He just like Rob just pointed his face to where Venia was gonna go. Like, you're that. gonna die here. No. Wow. No. Yeah. Beautiful I'm sorry. combo conversion coming Ooh. out from Venia, dragging down with the up air from a short hop. That ain't easy either, my friends. Beautiful stuff, like really good execution coming out from Benny, I should say, to be able oh, to do that. Oh. It's not just about oh. knowing what situations. <laughs> it's not just about knowing what situations you need to do those combos in. It's about the execution. And these guys, their execution is on point. That's what separates top players from low level ones. But the upper no. by the ledge, not gonna do it yet. My God. Good getup attack with the invincibility to be able to get around the Wally Wop, the armed robbery, whatever. By the ledge again, neutral as we said, good forward air, get off me, and double jumping to get around the gyro, and good patience coming out from Venia to not get hit by the down air either. These guys are all in each Woo! other's heads. And the uppy angle, these guys are like, one oh. of these guys should have died already. Uh, I'm so and he pops out of the up air. Uh, oh my god. Literally, this game should have been over like a no. minute ago, and he dies to, he died off the side to F tilt. After all that, yo, yep, there were like 30 kill moves that just happened on screen just now.
And Rob, one of the heaviest characters in this game, the way the match ends is you died at the ledge to Greninja forward tilt. Greninja. That was stupid. I'm just going to come out and say it. That was stupid. What an exchange coming out from these players. My voice is shot. Okay, I kind of want to um, acknowledge the fact that, like, I feel like people don't SDI towards the stage when they're getting hit by up air when trying to edge my rod. And I don't think people realize how good that is. Because if you just normal tech, you can kind of just hit Rob again for free. Maybe. He's, he's, not in the, he's not in the best amount of lag, but he's in kind of a decent amount of lag. And I don't feel like people consider that as an option. Yeah. That, that's Which I kind of just have to throw out. Because you obviously know it's, it's, it's hitting you, so if you just SDI in, then you're going to be ready to second. That sounds logical, yep. right? That, that, I hope. Yeah, yeah, that's a good observation. And also because I did that a few times, and I was really happy when I did it. Never mind. Anyways, back to this. Um, Yo, what kind reads, of damn read is that? The books. I don't like reading, right but now. I kind of just watched a book open in front of my eyes. And it was it was dill. Kind of reminds me of Jeopardy when like they uh, <laughs> Real Fast takes the stock when they faced off against like the HAL 9000 supercomputer or something. <laughs> kind of reminds me of that, except you know this time like you it. know the humans won. Up air, looking like a damn Mario out here. Look at all these up airs. Damage, but you're gonna <gasps> die because you pressed Whoa, the counter. Oh, wait, wait. You pressed the counter button when you were in advantage. But Benny of los cojones as he got there. This guy like. He will press buttons when he's in advantage that you should never press buttons when you're in advantage for. I know he makes spoke it Spanish. Hello. A little. A little. Yeah. I mean, I appreciate it. Because I was literally going to use that exact word to describe this this Greninja player. Clone is right. Yeah. But I was going to say it more like a Hispanic. I was just like... I'm Cuban. No, you're not. I don't believe that. Yes, I am. My father's straight up from the motherland. He came here during the Freedom Flights. Anyway. Good uh, double back air to get him off the level right there. And just forcing his advantage even further is, is, is you know, Venia. I think Greninja is very good on the stage, my friends. Not gonna sleep. It's good on Dill up being actually a little further back right there. And I think he did that because he suspected that Venia, because he was up in Ooh. stock, was gonna go for wait, a wait. down air by the ledge. But that is not the case anymore. Instead, he just gets dragged down low enough to the point where he can't make it back. We're down to last stock on the second game. I feel like that uh, side B wasn't intentional. Like, the way that he fell out wasn't intentional, but it kind of just worked out in case. You know what I mean? Yeah. Double fair. Okay. Right, he's just looking a little... Uh, face. I want you to die now. That's what he's saying. And now he's off the level. Don't get hit by no stray side bees, my friend. This is how it starts, okay. man. The damage tax off of one little exchange. That's what separates these guys from us, my friends. They take one little stray hit, and they expand upon that as far as they can possibly go. I, oh, and that's the grand finals. Venia advancing through the loser's bracket, taking it over Gil. Double eliminating him, I believe, right? Or, like, who is it, Venia... Venue no, it was John. I was thinking of John Numbers. I was thinking of John Numbers. My bad. Yeah. That was.